Hey guys, this is going to be a quick sketch of uh, Carl Malden from A Streetcar Named Desire. He is known for having a big nose, and I have a reference that I'm going to show right now. I'm going to, I'm going to try to keep this pretty quick. It's going to be a 10 minute sketch, 10 minute doodle. I'm going to start off with the hat. It starts up here, and it's going to end somewhere down here. And uh, this is going to be a caricature, so it's not going to be... <laughs> it's going to be realistic, but it's not going to look like a portrait portrait. Some of my favorite caricature artists they do a little more exaggerating than I do. That's uh, Sebastian Kruger. I like um, Drucker, Hirschfield, and uh, Levine. That old school style. Those guys are like real portrait artists. That's a motorcycle in the street. Real portrait artists that uh, they knew how to exaggerate and still capture the look of the actors. The thing about Malden is he has a big nose. And you look at it right away and it makes his mouth look smaller, even though his mouth isn't really that small. Just his nose looks, makes everything uh, smaller. So, I gotta really exaggerate that nose. minute drawing. Okay, let's see. I'm not sure if I want to keep the shadows where they are in the photo reference. I guess I could Bad job of measuring by me. So his his head should be wider at the top, and then it goes down. And more, and the chin. Get the jowls. some anatomy classes back in college and I don't remember anything. I mean, I know what's in what, or, you know, all the parts. I just don't remember the names. Seven more minutes. His face looks a little too thin. I'm gonna have to fix that. Go back to the nose. So if you're really out of time, bring out the old pencil. So you make it bigger lines with it.
not sure if I should do any shading or just describe the forms. I mean, I definitely won't have that much time to shade the whole thing. Also, shading is it's a crutch. If you're good enough, you could just do it in lines. And the fewer the lines, the better. It's a Hirschfeld thing. Hirschfeld. Hirschfeld? Carl Malden used to do these commercials later in life. You could hear how nasally his nose, his nose, his voice was because of his nose. Okay. Ear should be over here. Okay, about six, six and a half minutes. It's actually easy to draw people with exaggerated features. It's harder to draw people who are more plain, like news anchors and people like that. I'm gonna make his mouth even smaller. So in the reference, you could see the direction of his face. So even if it, you know, the proportions aren't correct, if you could get the general, the general proportions, relations, big nose, small mouth, longish chin. I mean, you can't rely too much on photo reference anyways, because there's a lot of retouching. So you won't see the bags under the eyes. Or wrinkles aren't as deep. But those are small details you don't really... You shouldn't have to concern yourself with. Every time I do these pencil sketches, pencil portraits and drawings, I think of the old uh, Phantom Menace art book. Uh, with McKegg. some details on here and then we'll call this sketch done
I guess to get more views I should be joining BTS or something like that. Taylor Swift. I'm really catering to the uh, 80 year old crowd. <laughs> I could have been drawing Brando at least. No. Carl Malden. So, if you like this video or you like these types of videos, please hit the like and subscribe. And, uh, I will do more. And hit the bell icon. Is that supposed to do something? Alright, thanks for watching.